How y'all doing today? This is Brick Central Studios, back here another video, and today we're doing an update and a haul video on you guys of my Black Falcon Army. As you can see out in front of you guys today, this is a package that came in the mail, and I put together all of the pieces that came with it, besides the guys on the horses these guys already had. I, just, uh, I got horse bartings for these horses, so now they are finally fully decked out, and I'm just going to show you slowly, I'll show, show you guys what I, uh, got in this haul today from uh, Pick a Brick and slowly uh, just show you guys what I got in detail and uh, yeah without further ado guys let's hop right into this video. So guys as you can see in this back left corner here of this base plate we do have another 12 of these Black Falcons with the uh, the big long swords and of course shields. I needed some more shields I mean more swords Jesus not sword more swords and shields I needed more swordsmen to add to the army so I can obviously have more numbers to equal to the buff course because I do have a lot of these uh, spearmen here and I needed to kind of start equaling out the numbers. So I do plan on getting some more swordsmen or at least more swords to possibly switch over some possible units that I already do have in the army. But if we do take a movement over here to the left of the base player or to the right, I should say, we do come to this middle portion, which I am starting to love a lot. These are my heavy knights that I just started to add to the uh, to the army here. We do have the leader here rocking this blue uh, blue plume on top of him, of course, rocking the shield and bigger helmet here. And behind him, we do have four of his heavy shields, heavy swordsmen, with of course the black um, black helmet bags with the. Uh, with the face armor here, the face armor, whatever, uh, I forget what this piece is called, but the, the front plume here, of course, is black to show the difference in leadership between the leader here of the heavy knights and this back portion. And of course, like you said, with these horses, we do now have all of my horses rocking these heavy, uh, these heavy bl uh, black falcon plumes here, not plumes, um, horse boardings, which look really, really nice. I really like these a lot, and to have every one of my horses basically horse barred it up which looks really nice and to have that all out in full clutches look gonna look really really nice for you guys coming up and i'm also confused if i'm gonna possibly get us sm another small horse legion that's not horse barred up that's kind of a more mobile unit on like these horses that are gonna be way more you know obviously sturdy because they have the armor and another update for the army as well i'm trying to figure out a new weapon replacement for this unit i'm thinking either swords or i'm going to do axes but i'm going to get them from brick warriors because i do have some very nice weapons that i've gotten from them in the past i know i've gotten the helmet for the archers from brick warriors and they look really really nice if you guys want to check out that video on my channel i did do an unboxing of the brick warriors um accessories for some of these guys none of them on this base play have any brick warriors this is all official lego pieces and these look really really nice and i definitely can't wait to grow the black falcon army up more and more for you guys but yeah, guys, this is just a quick little update, a quick little haul for you guys, and a quick update to for towards the Black Falcon um, army and kind of just that medieval town going on. Next order, I think I'm going to do pieces and I'm going to get some more Black Falcons, of course, because I'd love just getting more of these guys. But yeah, guys, appreciate you guys coming out, watching this quick little video on an update of my Black Falcon army, and until uh, next time, guys, deuces.